Good morning. It's now 626, but it's also tax time, and our money guy, Kurt Pearson, is here this morning. Yes, and we are down to crunch time now mm -hmm. on filing taxes. Every year, some tax returns have errors that can be very easily avoided. So for people who might be pushing it to the last minute, uh, what should they be looking for? On well, first of all, pushing it to the last minute always causes us to make mistakes. And yeah. so it may be something where people want to just go ahead and file the extension to give themselves a little bit of extra time. Of course, if you owe taxes, then you may be facing penalties and interest and so forth. So very important to consult with a tax professional if you're anticipating that type of an approach. But some of the typical errors, of course, signing the return mm -hmm. is very important. Mm -hmm. uh, math, simple math computation sometimes kick a, kick a return out. Of course, if there's a mismatch between what has been reported to the IRS from your employer and what you report, that's going to kick the return out and cause delays. So some of those basics are, are very important to, to, to get those right. The turbo taxes of the world have become so popular and so many people rely on them, but when you use them, you're always wondering, am I cheating myself out of money? That's kind of a debate to have, isn't it? Yes, it really is. And, and, and the, one of the key red flags about maybe it's time to you know, hire a professional mm -hmm. is if you've had something significant happen during the year, a major life transition, or if, if you've had a significant raise or certain events, very important maybe to get that tax professional involved. Now, if you're up against the deadline, you can go ahead and file using some of the software, mm -hmm. but then get into a tax professional after their season kind of wraps up mm -hmm. because then they can file a corrected return for you mm -hmm. if necessary. So you can get their advice even after the fact uh, so you make sure that your return is as accurate as it can sure be. you're not cheating. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, if you have questions that you would like Kurt to answer, you can always contact him at Compass Financial. Number there is 515-327-1023.